What's going on fam? Eric Ellis here back at it again with another fire ass video. In this video, we're gonna go ahead and teach you how to make $100 per day without making any YouTube videos. Now, first and foremost, you're gonna need a couple of things. You're gonna need to understand the concept that I've been using uh, to basically build my own life by design. Currently here in the penthouse in Miami, Florida, right? And what I used to actually build my income up and to be able to uh, live life on my terms is something called affiliate marketing, right? Now, affiliate marketing is super simple. All you are is the professional middleman. Basically, there's a person who has a problem, right? There's a person who has created a product to solve that problem. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna go ahead and be the person, the connector, right? To actually put those people together. And when you put those people together, every time a transaction is made, you're gonna go ahead and get paid a commission. Now, where do you actually find these products? What I would recommend is going on to something called ClickBank, right? ClickBank is an affiliate marketing platform where you can find people called vendors, right? Now, what a vendor is, is somebody who has taken the time aside to create the actual product, who has all the, the back-end processes like the uh, customer service and things along those lines. You don't have to worry all, uh, about all of that. All you have to do is literally step behind that as an affiliate. What they're gonna do is give you a unique affiliate link and when you get access to that affiliate link, you're gonna be able to actually promote that as a product. Now, the, the question is, how are we gonna go ahead and actually get people to that product, right? And how are we gonna go ahead and get people to that product to actually buy that product on YouTube without making any videos, right? Now, there's two ways people make money on YouTube. Number one is they make it through Google AdSense, which we're not talking about because that's publishing content. And then what YouTube does is they pay you a little small piece of pie because that traffic is worth so much, but they pay you a little bit, right? For people to actually run ads on your content. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and run ads on other people's content, but we're not actually gonna go ahead and use Google AdSense. We're gonna go ahead and reach directly out to these YouTube influencers to actually promote our products. Now, this is how we're gonna go ahead and do it. Basically, let's just say you go on ClickBank. I would highly recommend the top three niches, right? Health, wealth, and romance. First and foremost, what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to create a ClickBank account. Once you create that ClickBank account, you're going to be able to go to the marketplace. Once you go to the marketplace, you can go through different categories of products that make sense to you. Now, I would highly recommend products within the health, wealth, and romance niche, right? The reason why, because those are evergreen and people will always have problems, That niche is, those niches are never going anywhere. So those categories, health, wealth, romance. So what I would do is basically find one of those categories, start searching through products, see how much commissions you guys can earn on those products. Once you see how much commissions you guys can earn, the next step is actually looking at the actual products and doing research on the products. You wanna make sure that these products are ethical. The thing is that, to keep it straightforward with you, almost anybody can put a product up on ClickBank. Number one, it doesn't mean that people are gonna wanna buy that product. Number two, it doesn't mean that they're actual, actually ethical, right? So I like to make sure they're ethical and I like to make sure that the sales materials they create are going to actually get people to buy that product. Now, the way you're gonna be able to do that is actually looking at the product sales page, right? All you have to do to do that is literally click the link at the top once you click the link at the top, you're gonna go ahead and get access to the product sales page, right? You can watch it, see if it's persuasive. If it seems like you would buy it if you were interested in that product, then go ahead and step behind that product after you do your research and make sure it's ethical. Now, next step, we found the product. How do we get people to actually buy that product? What we're gonna do is I would recommend start searching keywords on YouTube like how to lose weight or how to lose weight fast or how to lose weight in one week if I was selling weight loss products. Or if I was trying to promote make money online products, I'm gonna go ahead and basically start typing in keywords that people would search if they were interested in the, the problem or solving that problem that my product is gonna solve. Meaning if somebody wanted to make money online, what are they gonna go to search in YouTube? How to make money online. How to make uh, money on YouTube. How to make money on Google, how to make money fast, whatever that looks like, how to make my first $10,000. You search those keywords and then influencers are gonna come up, right? Now an influencer is somebody who creates content around a specific subject and has built a following of people who know, like, and trust them. So the same thing within the romance niche, people who create content around people trying to attract the opposite sex, right? That's the problem. 
I'm gonna sell a product that's gonna solve that problem. But a lot of these influencers do not know how to monetize their following, right? So one way that you can tell them that they can monetize it is go to the about portion, the about section. Once you go to the about section, you're just gonna drop down and there should be a business email to where you can send business inquiries. Once you go ahead and click that business email, you're then gonna go ahead and reach out to that influencer and say, hey, listen, I see you've built an audience around this subject, weight loss, making money online, whatever that looks like, right? I have a product that I'd like you to do a review on. If you do a review, I'd be willing to pay you $50, $100, whatever that looks like. Now guys, if this person has thousands of pop people following them and they do a product review on your product, Obviously, you, that's why it's important to go ahead and do research and actually look into the product and make sure it's ethical because they're gonna be promoting this to their audience. You don't want them to burn their audience so you get a bad rep, right? Do research, give them exactly what they need to actually review the product. Then what they're gonna do is they're gonna go ahead and do a review on the product, go ahead and give a call to action to click the link in the description. And that link in the description is going to be your unique affiliate link. Now, there's two things that I would recommend. Number one, is instead of just using uh, the, the long ClickBank link or whatever affiliate product you're thinking of, go ahead and use a, uh, a, a link shortener. Literally go on Google and look at a link shortener. I use something called Bitly. You can use Bitly. Number two is I would highly recommend using um, a sales funnel, which is basically putting a, a little web page in front that captures emails. I use something called ClickFunnels. There's links down below that you can actually get access to the software that I use to build my, these little web pages. And basically what it does is it captures these leads, these emails for people to actually get access to your sales presentation. But what it allows you to do is actually follow up with those people on the back end, right? So you can start building a list or a following of people who know, like, and trust you just like they have that YouTube following. You can start building an email list. Same thing, a following is a following around a specific niche. You can start marketing to those people with your products, right? So that's what I want you to go ahead and do. I want you to go ahead and try that. Go on ClickBank find a product once you go ahead and find a product then you want to go ahead and uh or excuse me find a niche find a product uh do your research make sure it's ethical make sure it's profitable make sure you can make some good money off of it then go ahead and start reaching out to influencers business inquiries about business inquiries then simply go ahead and ask them if they can do a product review now some people's going to reach out to one person and i'm like well this doesn't work yes it does work it works only if you work it these people are looking to make money that's why they're building that's why they're building a following right so that they're not just doing it for their health. Yes, they like people, but they eventually want to start making money off of it. So obviously the bigger people's following, the more you're going to have to spend, right? So I'm not going to tell you the prices, fell forward, reach out to these people, see what works the best. And if you guys want a little bit more advanced training on affiliate marketing, if you guys want to actually learn how to build these web pages, if you want to learn how to start building these email lists, and start driving traffic to these landing pages or these little web pages, capturing those emails and learning how to do email marketing, learning what to say, how to market to these people. If you wanna learn like the advanced strategies that I've used to build my dream life, penthouse lifestyle, right? Go ahead and click the first link in the description or there's gonna be a button below if you're actually watching this on my email list and it will allow you to be able to apply for my one-on-one -on -one mentorship. So if you gain value from this video, go ahead and share it with a friend, but most importantly, smash that freaking like button. Punch it in the freaking face because it does help. And number two, uh, I appreciate you guys for tuning in. As always, your boy, Eric Ellis, checking out.